Jim and Words go on pages. Mr. Jim Mandrinox. I'm sorry, do I know you? No, but I know you. A great stalker. More of a fan, really. Oh, yeah. You like my writing? I uh, never read a word. <laughs> then exactly what are you a fan of? You doofus. The bravado, the risk taking, living your life on your own terms and cheating death. Nobody cheats death. Death always wins. Well, I'm glad you know that. It's refreshing. But I do have to say, spectacular in your near-death experiences. Survived two homicide attempts. I'm just lucky. The drugs alone should have killed you. Mm, that wasn't that bad. The 80s? Overrated. Greatly exaggerated. You dated your coke dealer. Well, you know, doesn't mean anything. June 12th through 15th, 1988, you stayed awake for four days snorting coke off the hoo-hahs of a pair of Guatemalan strippers walked into an emergency room as a possible OD and walked out 20 minutes later. <laughs> their, their ages combined didn't add up to my good times. But that was like a lifetime ago, dude. Nine car accidents, walked away from them all. Mm. You eat more red meat than should humanly allowed, no heart problems, smoked lucky strikes unfiltered for almost 15 years, no lung issues. Okay, so what's your point? You, sir, are a master at cheating death. We talk about you here. You're a legend in the afterlife. You're actually on our Mount Rushmore with Keith Richards, Betty White, and some dude who does motorcycle stunts. But today, alas, I am here to collect. What? I'm death, and I'm here to collect. Why the hell is death zooming me? I'm actually, okay, this is embarrassing. This is my mom's basement. New rules because of COVID. Yeah, it's gotta suck, but you need to stay safe, dude. You know, thank you for that. That's very generous. You're coming with me. So is this what gets me, the COVID-19? Uh, no, actually, we're going for a home accident. Really? A after all the ways they cheated death? You just said I was on your Mount Rushmore? And you're gonna have me go out like the I fall and I can't get up, lady? All right, you got a point. How do you want to go out? Old age. Okay, well, you're practically there. <laughs> yes. Hey, can we revisit the strippers and coke? Ooh, sorry, there's Me Too rules in effect nowadays. <laughs> How about I have an aneurysm while I'm screaming at Trump? Oh, all those slots are booked. Uh, do I at least get a phone call to say goodbye to people? I'm death, not jail. I'm the same thing. All right, well. Hey, I did I do anything to cheat death? Excuse me? Well, you said I, you keep saying I cheated death. And I said I was lucky, and you implied that I just cheated you. It's just an expression. Is it? No, okay, look, I'm supposed to let you play a game of chance, and if you win, you buy some time and I die. But if I win, since you risk my life, I'm gonna make your death really painful. So, you should probably just take the easy death now. Let's play. Crap. All right, fine. You have three guesses to try to figure out what song I'm thinking of. Really? Because there's like billions of songs. Could be anything, could be anything in the history of music. Not my problem, man. Is it Firework by Katy Perry? Bitch! It's so catchy. It's so catchy. <laughs> oh, the champion still undefeated against a Jim Mendrinos. <laughs> Come for me in another few years, bitches. I'm gonna stop smoking again. Hey, everybody. It's Amanda from NM. Did you like that sketch? I hope so. I bet you did. Uh, we got so much more where that came from. We've got two specials, allmediatv.com. You can go check it out. Do it now. We love you.